All right, folks, welcome back. Today we are going thrifting, getting things started off at one of our favorite Goodwills. This place is always loaded with shoes, golf stuff, you name it, they've got it. But I uh, never know what you're gonna find, so let's go find it. Let's go find it. Well, dang, they've got a ton of Christmas trees in here. And check out these. These were like super hot on eBay last year, weren't they? Oh, yeah. Like every single YouTuber was making videos about these saying they were going for like 300 bucks. My grandma had one, I remember from my childhood. Yeah, so. we've got one that's kind of like this, except you can like put meats and cheeses on it. It's, and it's a charcuterie tree. Charcuterie tree. It's pretty amazing, yes, but uh, yeah, they've got a lifetime supply of those. Also got this thing right here. It's pretty cool. Is this oh, a, uh, oh yeah, it is a cookie jar. What? That's amazing. Oh, these things are ceramic, right? I think that's the material they made. Oh, okay. Yeah, I have no idea. I think so. That's, that's pretty cool with. too. All right, let's go check out the golf clubs and the Christmas stuff. We got distracted on the way to the golf clubs. Ashley has got some, I think those are the 1080 uh, New Balance ones. So those things are supposed to be ridiculously comfortable. Yeah, they are, but I think there's half a size too half big. Half a size too big? I don't know. This year's model, right? Yeah, I think so. You guys know that we're big New Balance fans. We got and the old, old man uh, shoes. <laughs> and Vans, Ashley likes the uh, Vans. All right, I promise we'll show you the uh, golf clubs now. Or we might show you the stuff they haven't put out yet. We got a foosball table, some uh, tennis rackets. See if there's a golf club hiding in here. Uh, not seeing them. Oh, there's a ton of golf clubs though. Let's go check these ones out. Wow. Kind of like a uh, St. Patrick's Day uh, flag going on here too. Oh man, I think this is a full set of uh, some Titleist 981s. These are really cool. They got the uh, same font and script as the uh, 990s. Yeah. Well, they used the same font and script for a long time. Kind of a classic style. Got some Naples Bay. I don't think this is a full set. It's missing the uh, eight and nine iron. How much are these going for? Six dollars a piece. Got some Tommy Armor 845s. What is that? It's literally called a flipper. It's oh, a pancake nice. flipper. Pancake flipper. That's pretty uh, awesome. <laughs> Get a uh, Cleveland Vast knockoff. What else we got over here? Uh, got a couple more of those uh, Naples Bays. We got a wooden, well, it's an actual axe. <laughs> it's an actual axe. I thought it was a wooden putter for a I second. Probably putter. You could, yeah, world's greatest putter. She could putt with anything. Uh, not looking like there's anything worth picking up in terms of the uh, golf clubs, but they usually have a bunch of like golf apparel and hats and stuff, so we'll mm. check that out as well. Is it a bag? Is that pretty nice though? Yeah. yeah. These are pretty cool. I would definitely pick those up if it was a full set. Got a couple of cool hats over here. A Tiger Woods, a uh, Nike one, got an Under Armour one. I think this is a, uh, oh nice, a uh, Ping G10 one. That is uh, kind of cool. World Golf Championship Bridgestone Invitational. Got a bunch of uh, golf hats. But, uh, oh man, look at this one. That one's awesome. Go perfectly with my uh, old man uh, shoes and sh uh, <laughs> shoes and uh, shirt. <laughs> Your shirt is pretty amazing. Yeah, right? that is pretty awesome. Slazenger Valhalla hat, three ninety nine. I think I'm totally gonna pick that one up. Oh, kind of cool. Yeah, Little Mickey, Mickey uh, balloons. balloons. All right, let's go check out the uh, ladies uh, section over here. Oh, I think those are uh, Echo. Oh, they do kind of look like it. Yeah, Echo, <laughs> Echo Golf Shoes. I think yours, these are size 39, you're size 37. Uh, yeah. 37, yeah. Yeah, they're yeah. probably too big. Those are pretty cool though. How much are they going for? Some of the Echo ones, especially like the yak leather ones, go for a ton. Yeah. Uh, $10 on those. Premium. Yeah. That's a good deal. I like the Echo shoes, but they're like really heavy. They're just... Yeah, they're so well made, but they're very like... Yep. Heavy. Yeah, they're not great. I don't You're not know. walking 36 in those. You ain't walking. There are no Skechers. Go golf shoes. <laughs> no. But uh, we'll uh, check out uh, some other stuff and uh, let you know if we find anything else. Updates cool. to come. That's a pretty awesome hat. All right, ended up picking up that hat and Ashley found a couple of uh, Fabletics uh, leggings in there too for $4.19. So couldn't pass that one oh. up. That was a heck of a deal. I always forget though, is uh, Lululemon or Fabletics? Which one's the more? What's the more popular? I have no idea. Oh, but yeah. for four dollars. I know there's a Fabletics. Fabletics. Yeah, there's a Fabletics at uh, Disney Springs. Yeah, and I think there's a Lululemon's at like the premium outlet. outlet. Yeah, so maybe that one's premium. I don't know. I don't know which one's premium. That would require me knowing something about fashion. Yeah. But for four dollars, I'm excited. If you've seen my uh, shirt, shoes, and hat today. You don't know. I, you know I don't know anything about uh, fashion. Just throw things. You together. always look good though. <laughs> But that will meet you at the edX spot. Wherever it is. <laughs> no fashion tips here. No. All right, stopping off for a quick bite to eat. We still got a couple more stores that we're going to go to, but whenever we're in Daytona, we got to say hi to Bucky. Oh, look, there's a giant Christmas blow Oh, they've got the uh, Christmas stuff out. We'll have to get a uh, seasonal t shirt. The blow ups, yeah. Oh, we got the Christmas one out. How's it going? Oh. <laughs> It's not about what's under the tree. There you go. Oh, I think you have one for pretty much every holiday. Now I need more. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's go grab some food. Yeah.
Oh, and just like Epcot, we are eating on top of a trash can over here. We're splitting the turkey sandwich. These things are absolutely gigantic. Mm -hmm. Also, if you've never been to Bucky's, it's like a gigantic uh, gas station that also has a ton of uh, cool stuff it's in like there. It's like the amusement park of gas station. Yeah, the food is really good. We'll throw mm -hmm. up some uh, B-roll. Whoa, turkey That's sandwich. Stuff. That thing is so good. Every time. Every time. It's definitely uh, worth your stop if you're in uh, Daytona. There's a bunch of them all over the place, but this is the closest one to us. We used to live very close to here, and we used to come here a little bit too often. <laughs> also, as always, went with the Arnold Palmer. Oh no, you, you went rogue. I went you rogue. got the green tea one. I'm sorry. I failed you all. This is not good. Unsubscribe for that. <laughs> I'm sorry. I got extra sauce because I like it saucy, but it really doesn't need it. It doesn't need it. I didn't know that you can get extra sauce. You yeah. this little thing. Now you know. Also, there's no like uh, tractor trailers or anything, but you will see like RVs. Yes. This place is fascinating. They also and the make ice their is own. Really cheap. Yeah, they make their own ice. That's why they can charge so little. Also, they sell more pulled pork sandwiches than their like uh, soft drinks, which are only like 59 cents. Fascinating. Right? Hopefully, this is fascinating. Next stop, <laughs> uh, I promise, will be more interesting if you're not into Bucky's. But we'll meet you there. We'll meet you there. But will Bucky you there? What were you saying? I was gonna say. But now we're not hungry, so you don't want to shop hangry. There you go. Words to live by. There you go. No fashion advice, but... <laughs> don't shop hangry. Don't shop hangry. <laughs> Alright, we'll meet you at the next spot. All right, we are fueled up and ready to go. We got a heavy hitter right here in this little strip mall. We got Goodwill, a pawn store that is moving slash going out of business kind of thing, and a golf shop, one of our favorites in Daytona. So it should be pretty spectacular. All right, haven't you made it back to the golf clubs yet? And check this out. This is awesome. A 2008 Masters hat. I love the yellow. It's yeah, so cool. the uh, golf apparel is hitting today. Oh man, check this out. We got a Ben Hogan Apex oh, iron right there. This thing is absolutely beautiful. Man, the 99 of the Ben Hogan ones are my favorite, but can't go wrong with any of the uh, Apex uh, irons. We got a couple of US Kids golf clubs down here. That's got a full cool set. Wilson Tour X. Oh, it's a prescription to go yeah, on tour. Prescription for uh, your uh, yeah. <laughs> my terrible <laughs> your golf game. game. <laughs> got a zebra putty right here going for uh, $8. That is pretty cool. Mm -hmm. Oh man, check this out. We got a 907 D. We just found that a uh, flea market. The uh, clubs. Now I got a matching head cover. <gasps> Whoa, check that out. That's awesome. That's like fully embroidered too. Yeah. And it's still got the plastic on the legs. That's pretty That crazy. is super cool. It's only 15 bucks. You don't usually see the uh, stand ones for like mm -hmm. the uh, merchandise or merch like ones. The, the, the cart bags. Yeah, that's awesome. That was sell perfectly out at the F flea market. Oh yeah. <laughs> Whenever we have like a, a beer one, they always like the first things to sell. Instantly. Yeah, that's that cool. is super cool. Well, let's get the, yeah, the, oh, we got the, yeah, got everything but uh, golf clubs today so far. It's not full of beer. Well, maybe. <laughs> Let me shake it up. <laughs> Remember we bought, uh, bought the, uh, it was like a Budweiser uh, cart bag. And the guy's like, I don't want it, I drink Coors. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's full of golf balls. I wonder if it's like a promotional tease. Nope, uh, just nope. random. Oh, but there's a Nike Mojo. Let's go. There you go. Jake from State Farm. This is meant to be. <laughs> <laughs> Literally finding a head cover to the club we uh, bought earlier and Lots there you go. Randomness. That was on the main channel though. Yeah. <laughs> this might be the main channel. I have no idea what we're doing. That's pretty sweet though. Uh -huh. Well, the Goodwill is full of uh, treasures. Pawn shop didn't have anything, but let's uh, see if Alexis Golf Shop has some stuff for us. They always have a ton of uh, golf clubs in here. Okay. All right, check this out. We got a full set of uh, Nike irons right here, Nike slingshots, and we got a uh, Vapor uh, driver right here, the Vapor Speed driver. That is pretty sweet. We got a TaylorMade RBZ set over there, some Ping G15s. Burner 2.0s. Burner 2.0s. Those have held their value like uh, crazy. Mm -hmm. Oh man, these are awesome. Adam's Idea Pros. Which shafts? Oh, they got the black gold shafts. We have a uh, set of those and they've got steel fiber shops in there mm -hmm. those things are definitely one of my uh, favorite ones we got some Callaway X tours Phil used these uh, when they first came out got some 360 XDs what else we got over oh man so Adam's overload in this bag Adam's uh, tight lies got Adam's super s we just found the uh, LS version of that I absolutely killed that at, yes, we got it for 40 bucks at uh, Edwin Watts that was the furthest uh three would have ever hit in my life oh without a doubt Wilson tour staff, oh that thing was uh, really cool looking what else we got over here oh man we got a bunch of uh Scotties got a uh, ping zing 2 Cobra milled putter which one is this one that is pretty cool I think it's a Della Cruz. I'm not sure though. Can't read that. Whoa, baby Jordans. That's pretty yeah. amazing head cover. Those are cool. Let's see what kind of scatters we got. We got a Rife putter right here. Got a Red X. Got the Phantom. This one's pretty sweet. What do we got? Squareback 2. That is pretty sweet on that one. I think I've said pretty sweet a thousand times. Betting already hidden in there too. Oh yeah, nice. 
my vocabulary as soon as the uh, camera turns on goes to uh, nothing. That's awesome. A Scotty Cameron uh, visor right there. Got some Scotty Cameron head covers. Mm -hmm. Let's see what we got back. Oh man, check this out. Full set of Ping Eye 2 Beryllium Coppers. One iron all the way down to the uh, wedge. Well, and a sandwich. Putter. Yeah, <laughs> right? that is pretty uh, sweet. I always like the look of these uh, Cleveland black irons. Mm -hmm. Those are cool. I think I've said sweet four more times. Cool. <laughs> oh, here's the uh, driver we were just talking about. The uh, three. Well, this is the driver of that three wood Super LS speed line. Hundred and twenty nine dollars on that one. Oh, check this. Out. I think this. You don't see the sixty four degree one very often. That has a really interesting grind to it. Let's see if that's a. Oh yeah, it does. Oh yeah, it is. It's literally hand stamped, so it's a two ratio Vokey. Oh, that's cool. That is awesome. That is definitely something that we're gonna pick up. Yeah. I don't have a sixty four degree wedge. And tourist is pretty awesome. Yeah, it's a bonus find. Bonus find for sure. Right, let's see if there's anything else worth picking up. Got a bunch of the uh, Moxby Blacks of the uh, Square Drivers. We always say this. It's uh, one of the uh, better looking ones. Just kind of. <laughs> this one also has a. Yeah, that's one of the. That one sounds terrible. The FTI. Definitely baseball bat. Aluminum baseball bat. Aluminum bat for sure. Got a bunch of uh, Tour Edge hot launches over here. Nike Covert. Oh, there's a nice set of the uh, newer Ben Hogan ones, Equalizer Wedge. We just picked up a set of those. We got, we bought them like six months ago and I didn't like them. Mm -hmm. And then we got them with the uh, graphite shaft, which is weird to have in a wedge. Yeah, that's the exact same shaft, but I really liked those ones. Kind of a uh, strange combination. Whoa, check this out. This is an old Hanma. Whoa, Whoa. that is beautiful. I have wooded the urge to say sweet. That is... That is pretty sweet. <laughs> <laughs> you got it uh, over for us. But uh, all right, we'll let you know if we find anything else. We're definitely going to pick up that wedge. Yeah, that's cool. All right, well, how about that? A tour issue wedge. That is uh, pretty awesome. But hopefully, you guys did like this video. Lots of uh, fun today. We got some Buckies, got that Budweiser bag. Lots had of some randomness. Yeah, we could have had a lifetime supply of those uh, charcuta trees or whatever we were calling them. <laughs> yes. But I uh, hope you guys did like this video. If you did like one, subscribe. And we'll see you next time. See you next time, guys. Thanks for watching. Daily vlog number 30. 39-ish? 38? 39.5, we'll call it that. You're just gonna keep talking, so I have to keep waving, aren't you? Yep. There? You know the drill. Ceramic trees, that's why. Ours is a cute Ceramic tree. trees, there, there you go. go. Bye. Thanks for watching. No, you can't follow me. <laughs>